Hey team, how are we? We're back. We are finally out uh, of isolation here in SA, which is which is good. Um, we've got away for the long weekend with the with fam. With the fam, it's been um, nice. We're headed up to John S. Christian Reserve, which is just a little reserve out of Walker's yeah. Flat. And we'll chuck the link in the bio um, if you guys want to check it out. Beautiful spot, yeah. plenty of old yeah. uh, farmhouse ruins around, so worth it, worth checking it out. Yeah. We're going to do a, a beef casserole. Um, it's going to be a ripper. We did a roast last night. Mm, that was um, good. It was beautiful. So very nice. We'll, we'll take you along. Um, we got some pretty cool trips planned. Well, our plans changed sort of 2020, didn't they? Changed. Changed. They changed. They changed real good yeah. um, in 2020, like everyone else's. But we got some cool trips planned. We might head up to Dalhousie and yes. which, yeah, play by ear. So, but keep yeah. an eye out for that. Plenty of work we've been doing on the canopy um, and on the car. Which so we'll do another video for that as well. Yeah, we'll get out. Show you yeah. I am a big fan of a good slow cooked casserole. Um, we do it nearly every time we go away. Um, we're going to show, show you what my secret recipe is. Yeah. Um, beef casserole. All the bits and all the bits and pieces. Yeah. The stout for lads. It's a must have must have ingredient. So we'll jump over in the kitchen and um, Yeah, shall we go and make this beef casserole? Let's do it. We're in the kitchen, we're ready to go. We're going to do our uh, my famous beef casserole and we'll go through the ingredients. Yeah, mine. Uh, but we're not going to tell anyone, so give it a second. All right, so my handy help here is just going to So we've got a couple of herbs thyme and rosemary, yep. uh, yeah. salt, pepper, oh. garlic. Pepper. Garlic. You've got to keep up with it, love. <laughs> so we've got crushed tomatoes, a tin of that, <clears throat> tomato paste, some veg, so we've got. A couple of uh, colour spuds, <coughs> carrot broccoli, bacon, can't go without bacon. Diced Some beef. Some pre, pre diced beef, you get that from Woolies and Coles. Otherwise, you can just dice it yourself. Uh, beef stock, gravy powder, stout is the secret ingredient. A bit of flour to help thicken stuff up and a bit of oil to get it going. So, we're going to cut this up and, and we're going to chuck it in. All right, we've diced up the veggie. Uh, we're just going to dice up some bacon. Look, you could use as much bacon as you like. Uh, we love our bacon, so we're going to cut a lot. And uh, lucky the beef's already cut. So now, I'm no chef, I'll give you that, but it tastes good. You've got to taste it to believe it. Give it a crack. There's our bacon. Alright, got the beef. Open it, pack it up. And with the garlic. Now it's time to head over to the fire. Casserole in a Duri with a spun steel camp oven. Put that on a pretty high heat to start with so that we can brown the meat. Good dash of oil, we'll let that get nice and hot and then we'll add the, the beef and bacon. Alright, always nice and hot. Let's get the uh, beef in, brown it off. Let's not tuck that in. Now we don't want to cook the whole lot, but we want to brown it off on a nice heat and then we're going to turn it down. Add the bacon. And add a good amount of garlic. Mix it all up. When 
Mental Brand, and I'm just ready to add the rest of the ingredients. Next up, we've got our herbs, thyme, and rosemary. Good dash of both of them. And then good seasoning, good salt and pepper. Sauce. So we've got tomato paste, good squeeze of that. Yeah, the crushed or diced tomatoes. Stout. So the boys have just gone to go get some firewood um, and I just thought that I would take you around this campsite and show you how beautiful it is. Let's go. Forty-five minutes now. We're gonna take a lid off, have a bit of a stir, and see what she's looking like. That is looking ripper. I reckon what we'll do is we'll leave the light, uh, so the lid off, uh, let it thicken up, and we'll uh, should be ready to eat in twenty minutes. Yeah. So you don't have to eat like a plate when you go and camp. There you go. Okay. Is it good? Mm. Hot? It's hot. <laughs> this is actually really good though. Like it's thickened up. Why are you surprised? It's thickened so well. But why are you surprised? <laughs> it's always good. No. Give it I'll a like, crack. I'll wipe the recipe up and put it in the, in the description below. Enjoy. Hit like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Make sure you hit the little bell symbol so you get alerted when that video comes out. Everyone does. Yeah. <laughs>